sat here a fucking month. No quicksilver anywhere. Last Put me in there. Some vengeance. Spawn Sasu, who works in Hopper. Okay. Well, I can do that now. So, what we need to do is go to A, C, or D. Well, A sucks. Let's go to C or D. start guys um how's quarantine treating everybody today so far my day my quarantine's been a little bit of a month but that's a tale for another story I hope I can be of help to you, knight. I'm not a knight. How goes the work, master? Getting there, getting there. You need something, my boy? What are you doing here, anyway? You're in an engraver's shop, my boy. We're engraving, of course. Yeah, but engraving what? And what's it used for? Oh, we engrave wood and stone as well as metal. Here in the monastery, it's mostly about decoration. You work You've got work? quite a large workshop, Master. You don't do all the work alone, surely? I'm usually here with my apprentice, Florian. And of course, by simple observation, you'll note that this is not currently the case, and I'm here alone. Which means that either I'm a liar or something out of the ordinary has occurred. Um, I see. I think. So what's happened to Florian? He shares the faith of the pharaohs, but today, the fifth scourge of Egypt did smite him. The plague. Or so his message advised me. Jesus Christ, the plague? Do remain calm. I'm quite certain the plague from which Florian is suffering wasn't a judgment from on high. Or if it was, it was a judgment on excessive drinking. I'm told such an ailment can be of truly biblical proportions. What's he like, your apprentice, Florian? I'm afraid that his exuberant youth has taken its toll. He's been acting strangely of late. I fear he has delusions of persecution. I don't really know what you mean, at all. Recently, for example, he told me that someone was following him. And the very next day he bought a padlock from the blacksmith and locked up his chest. As though I would ever sneak into it. In any case, why the interest? Are you looking for him? Something like that. May I ask why? I have a message for him. A message? Who would be interested in that wastrel? Other than his furious and deeply disappointed master, of course. About your question, you'll find him at home. No doubt feverishly dying. He sleeps in the baker's cellar. Ah, oh, thank you. Well, that was easy. Does Florian have any enemies? A man such as he certainly owes money at every turn, and the parents of local girls are undoubtedly displeased with his attempts to propagate. However, most recently it was that fury from the baths who accosted him in quite a spectacular rage. Bath a woman from the baths? What did she do? The harpy nearly tore all Florian's hair out. I don't frequently feel sorry for my ne'er-do-well apprentice, but on that occasion I made an exception. Do you have any idea why she did it? She was screaming about some girl, some flighty bathmaid, Esther. I would say that Florian had felt the joys of spring and acted accordingly, although one would have thought they'd be used to that sort of thing at the bathhouse. All right. Thank you. I think that's enough. I'll leave you to your work. Go. Take care now. All right. So we get to the D now. We have Bass, Pac-4, 
Tyrion. Let's go to the barn. So let's go to B. Let's go visit Warian. Because maybe he has something good for us. I mean, it's my first thought. We should go for the guy that we're after. Kind of random. Why is A so big? Well, I mean, what I've seen, we were about halfway through the main storyline. And like I said in the past, if you guys want more videos on this, just let me know. I'll be more than happy to. It's a whole... I'm curious what's the story. You look mad. God save. How may I help you, good knight? I hear you're at odds with Apprentice Florian. At odds? I'll give you at odds. It's that sod's fault they took my Esther. Poor girl. I shudder to think what's become of her. What? What exactly happened? This man came in wanting a bath, and Esther with it. She doesn't normally offer that kind of service, but I didn't see the harm, so I sent her in to him. And suddenly I hear screams, so I run out, and I see the bastard pulling her out of the tent and shoving her into a boat. What? I'm sorry they took her, but what exactly has it got to do with Florian? They shouted at me to tell Florian that when he wises up, he'll get the girl back. I assume that Florian knows this, Esther. You know, village girls. They don't get much of a choice. Every other knave has a turnip for a brain. And if they don't, they're relatives. Fair. And then some young dandy turns up who writes her little poems. What's the poor girl to do? And this is how it ends. She should have stuck with the turnip heads. Hmm. Where can I find this Florian? I'd like to ask him a few questions. He works in the engraver's workshop at the Monastery Craftsman's Yard. And if he's not there, he'll be holed up like the rat he is in the cellar he rents from the baker. He's afraid of me, for sure. Bailiff? What did the bailiff make of it? Don't even get me started on that. He's another fine leaf. I won't say what. I told him everything, but he says he won't do nothing about it. How's that then? He wouldn't tell me to my face, of course. But people here don't think much of us. There's some as reckon my Esther deserves what she got. Poor girl. Okay, her again. It sounds like you were close to Esther. I loved her like my very own. She came to me as an orphan, like a wolf child she was. I raised her and taught her and gave her a job. And now she's gone. Who knows if she's even alive? I'd like to, uh, order something here. Uh-huh. And what do you want? The one we never did was, uh... Proper bath. bath. And my clothes need washing. As you wish. Do you have the coin? Ten dollars? Fine. Fine, there I'll it is. tell the people for it later. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. God bless. Uh, to be fair, we haven't bathed once, so we're probably filthy. You know, the one guy we never really talked to. There he is. I am honored that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. I'm not a knight. You look quite sprightly for an invalid. What? Who the hell are you? My name's Henry, and I'm making inquiries for Sir Radzig Kobola. And what do you want from me? Straight to the point, then. All right. I've been investigating counterfeit money, and the trail led me straight to you. Does the name Rapata mean anything to you? Um, 
I, I don't know. Maybe? Uh, don't bother. I know you know him. You make the punch dies for the counterfeiters. How do you hand them over? Do you know where their workshop is? I can't say anything. I'll deny everything and you've got nothing on me. No evidence, just accusations. It's got something to do with that girl, hasn't it? How do you know? That doesn't matter. Mm. No, I, I suppose not. I didn't want to get involved, I swear. Those bastards kidnapped Esther. If I don't cooperate, they'll kill her. I'm sorry about that. Me too. Mm. Listen, I'll tell you everything, I promise. But only if I know that Esther's safe. What, so I'm to go searching for her in the woods? I know where they're keeping her, but nobody will help me. And what can puny little me do faced with those oh, strapping no. great villains? Look, Florian, I'm sorry for what you're going through, honestly. But I'm not the only one who's after these people. As soon as they get wind of something, they'll be out of here and Esther will be gone with them. If Rapporteur finds I've told you anything, they'll kill her. Not if I catch Rapporteur first. He's here in town, isn't he? Yes, he is. Where? They found me in the tavern one evening. Caught me when I went to the ship pile. They started to badger me about working for them. They? Yes, Rapporteur. On a night they called Sir Yezek. And then what? Yezek. They explained what they wanted from me and I told them to sod off. I'm guessing that didn't go down too well. It wasn't all that bad. They just threw me on the dung heap and left. I thought it was just a drunkard's joke. But then they took Esther. Hmm. Where will I find Rapporteur? He's usually wherever I am. What does that mean? He watches me. Everywhere I go. And when I'm at home, he sits on the bench in the square, watching my house. So he's there now? Hard to say. Sometimes I see him in the tavern on the green, buying supplies. All right. At least I know where to start. And you go to work tomorrow, you hear? Why? <coughs> because we have to lure him out. And besides, your master will surely be glad to see you. I have my doubts. How did you hand over the punch die to them? Rapporteur waited for me behind the church. I didn't want to give it to them without seeing Esther first. And did they let you? Yes, although I don't really know why. They took me to a derelict farm in the Scallets Hills. Scallets. My poor Esther. They'd scared her half to death. So at least you know she's alive. Who knows? It was a while ago. And they never let her go, even after I did what they wanted. They said they'd be needing more. More punch dies? They wear out over time. And they have to be replaced regularly. Why didn't you tell anyone? At first, I took it for a bad joke. And then, when they snatched Esther, there was nothing to be done. Uh -huh. I suppose I'd better go. I'd hate the bastard to get away. Go. I hope you get revenge. See you later. Don't sing it. You fool, you'll bring some terrible misfortune on us. No!
Stayed home. Well, hi, bandits. What are you doing? Why are you just sitting around? Why not? Admiring the view. People just do not appreciate a lovely view these days. Does the name Rapporteur ring any bells for you? Rapporteur, you say? Rapporteur. Hmm. No. I can't hear any bells ringing at all. Look, you little jester. I'm investigating a crime against the king on the direct orders of Sir Radzig. Are you really going to keep pretending you don't know anything? Hang on! What's all this about a crime against the king? I'm just keeping an eye on things. When a wagon comes in, I make sure nobody robs it. I get a commission for that. That's it. See? That didn't hurt a bit. Bit of friendly advice. You're wasting your time here. Rapid is scarpered and won't be coming back this way anytime soon. Hmm. You might as well pack up and go home. What? That bastard owes me a dozen groschen. Damn it! Now what? Ah, oh, well. No use hanging around here anyway. In any case, thanks for the information. I could have been stuck here for weeks. I'm kind of shocked that went better than I expected. Well, let's go back to town and we're going to talk to people, see if we can get something good to happen. Because it's kind of like nothing's really happening. But actually, let's go ahead and do things off here. Next time on Kingdom Come Deliverance. We'll make it day and we'll go do some stuff. I'll see you then.